Hi vlog, what is up? Today I'm going to be making cheesecake. Now I've never made cheesecake before, so this could go one of two ways. One, it turns out really bad and horrible and I destroy my mom's kitchen and she gets really mad at me and then I don't even... Anyways, and then I don't even end up posting this vlog because it turned out so bad. Number two, it turns out really great and I end up becoming Rachel Ray and being on the newspaper. Nobody reads the newspaper anymore. I end up being on CNN for how great my cooking abilities are. Yeah, that might not happen because I think I just broke this pan. See, this thing just came out of this. So, <gasps> all right, I think I fixed it. Yep, okay, never mind. we're good. I really have no idea what I was talking about. Let's just hope and pray that this cheesecake turns out wonderful and great and just wonderful. I have all of my ingredients over here displayed. And then over here, I have the recipe. So I'll link it down below if you wanna make it. <laughs> Let's get started. <laughs> Step one, we need to cut this. Okay, we need to cut this parchment paper to this. Oh my God, do you guys remember when everyone used to make these? I made this. Okay. Okay, I need to play some music. Alexa, connect to MacBook Air. This is a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be to cut out a circle. Whoa, they opened a new Chick-fil-A in New York. That's a big Chick-fil-A. I'm gonna go to New York just for that reason. I need to put you guys up here again because I need my coffee. Duh. Mix graham cracker crumbs and cinnamon. Add butter or margarine. We're gonna use this handy dandy tool. Oh, look at that! Thank God that was right over the bowl. My neighbors are gonna think I'm murdering someone over here. I have my graham cracker crumbs. Now we need to add cinnamon. Found it. I'm actually following the rules today and leveling this off with a knife because I want my family to be proud of me. Now we're just gonna mix this around with a fork. Now that we have this all mixed around, we're gonna add our butter, which I have to melt. What if this thing like overflows? Oh. Good news, it's not overflowing. I really hope I'm doing this right. Is I supposed to spray this? All right, I'm going in. I'm pretty proud. This looks amazing. Not to toot my own horn. Thank you. We're just gonna pop this in the freezer. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like because I'm pretty proud of it. Look at that. Wow. I know, I'm super good. You can just crush all the food. Next step, make filling. Oh my God. This thing weighs like 500 pounds. Maybe one day I'll be on Cupcake Wars. My dream job as a kid was to just be a cupcake taster on Cupcake Wars. You know, like that one Russian guy? I wanted to be like him. That's just what I wanted my job to be. And I was completely serious. I had several issues as a child. Does this go in the recycling? We're just gonna put it in the trash. I'm so kind to the earth. Okay, we're just gonna put this fat bowl of cream cheese in the microwave. Dump it in. Thank you. 
Oh, that was a different consistency than I thought it was gonna be. Okay, no one wants to like lend me their account password for Spotify Premium. It would be greatly appreciated because I hate Spotify not premium. Now for the fun part. So satisfying. My mom's gonna kill me, I'm using so many dishes. Okay, every time I spill the vanilla everywhere. So today's goal is to not spill the vanilla everywhere. Oh, that goal already went away. I just spilled, oh, okay. God, there's vanilla all over the bowl. She's thick. I still have to add the eggs, which apparently I have to whisk together. This recipe is so extra. I really hope these eggs don't taste like soap because that happened to me the other day. I washed the apple cutter and then I cut my apple and the apples taste like soap. It was disgusting. Now we add five eggs and I'm not gonna drop them. I should try the thing where you crack it with one hand. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Now we're just gonna use the whisk and whisk it together. This is such a weird sound. I want you guys to see this. You're welcome. I almost just knocked my coffee into the cheesecake. Oh my God, that looks so disgusting. Got some cream cheese on my nose. This is gonna be the new beauty trend. Just a little bit of cream cheese on the nose. The new highlight. Dang, look at that cream cheese. <laughs> wow, that was really satisfying. I think we have successfully made cheesecake. I'm speechless. Do I still have cream cheese on my nose? Yes, I do. Oh man, now it's in my hair. I saw them do that on the video, so. Bake for 12 minutes. Turn oven to 350 and bake until top of cheesecake turns golden 50 to 60 minutes. Okay, that makes no sense. God, I'm really scared of ovens, fun fact. Yes, I am putting on oven mitts to put the cheesecake in. Don't judge. That was scary. I'll see you guys in 12 minutes. Oh, my camera's dying. I took the cream cheese off because my hair kept getting in it. Our cheesecake is done. It overflowed a little bit. It's a little, uh, kind of jiggles. I guess it's fine. I don't know. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't know if I did this right. We'll just have to see what my mom says. That will determine if this is wrong or not. Okay, so little update on the cheesecake. It's cooled for about 45 minutes. It kind of rised down. It also doesn't bounce anymore. So that's good. I think that's a good sign. I think this was a success. 